Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys my style journey. Basically, we're going to start from 2016 and look at pictures of me from back then all the way up to now and look at my fashion sense and just see how I've grown mainly um with what I've been wearing since then because I really want to make this channel fashion based but let's just get right into it okay so this first photo is me like holding like this bird I don't even know what bird this is they brought it to my school one day in middle school um I'm wearing like this sweater that says Vans on it it's all maroon I've I lived this sweater I wore it like every single day back then and it was kind of an issue it's even in this this photo which is from the a subway in New York City when I went with my dad um our, again I'm wearing that sweater and I'm wearing like these gross like red sweatpants um not really too fond of that and then I'm also wearing these like workout like jogger not jogger like I'm running shoes they're pink I mean, I'm not my favorite, but I'll take it. And then we, me and my sister both, ha me and my sister both had these like weird purses from, I want to say my parents brought them back for us from Germany, but I have a black one and she has a pink one. They just were like really long, so I don't know the why that was like the bag of our choice, but okay. This is another picture. Um, I'm not really the biggest fan of what's going on here. That jacket had a lot of rips in the sleeve, which was kind of gross. And this, I don't know, this top is just like a tank top and it has like flowers on it. I mean, like, I guess it was okay for back then. Like, it, I guess it was cute for like middle school. But again, um, this is when I decided to curl my hair. And I'm wearing like this weird backwards cap and I'm all like... You know, and this like top is just from Forever 21. It was a little clear though, so I had to like... I don't know. I guess I don't know if I actually wore anything underneath it, but whatever. Um, this picture is gross. It's gross. I'm wearing these like vans, like from I don't know. They have like this weird material or whatever. Um, and then I'm like I wore those shoes like till death though. Those shoes have like a bajillion holes in them. Then I had to throw them out because they were gross. But the leggings I'm wearing are like. I kid you not though, I wore leggings like every single day of middle school or like since like literally not even middle school, since like elementary school and it was so gross. I don't know why I thought that was like a good idea because it really wasn't but we went with it so now we're, we're moving on. But they have like these flowers on it and I want to say they were like a weird like navy blue color. Not really black but like navy blue. This top, I want to say I thrifted this top. This tank top or whatever I'm wearing, I don't really know. I have not seen that in years. I got rid of it. It's gross. I got rid of everything in this picture. Besides, I think the jacket is probably somewhere, though. The jacket was actually my dad's. So that's why it looks like a weird men's jacket. I don't know. I wore a lot of my dad's clothes for some reason, like his jackets. I don't really know what to tell you. This is also really, really gross. Please take a look at this phone case. Like, what is that? And then there's, like, what is my hair doing? I don't part my hair like that anymore. And then I'm wearing, like, a choker. Like, why am I wearing a choker? Why am I wearing a choker? That's gross. And these jeans are, like, my mom's. And these, the shoes I'm wearing, if you can kind of see them down in the corner here. Um, they're right here. I literally wore, the, I still, I wore those literally like yesterday because they're still like nice shoes and like if I wear them with the right outfit it looks okay but these jeans are like disgusting they were my mom's but they were just like really baggy on me and like so was the sweater and I want to say the sweater was from like Yellowstone or something I'm just I don't know what was I thinking like what was I thinking when I decided that that was the outfit okay um again this is a little bit better I have like these French braids in with like some plain black glasses same shirt from earlier with the beanie um, and the braids again but I don't know this is a little better I'm a little mad that you can see like my bra strap which is kind of annoying but I kind of look cute in this picture I'm not really big fan of my eyebrows though those are kind of a hot mess 
but anyway moving on this picture is from it's from pride i yeah i'm not sure what year this was but it's from pride with my best friend i had curled my hair that day i'm wearing like these heart sunglasses up on my head which i know for a fact they were too big for my head i like i know for a fact they're too big for my head i swear they either no i think i got rid of those just kidding i got rid of those 100 percent I'm wearing like these hoops, which weren't even mine. I like found them somewhere. I don't know where they are now. I'm pretty sure I got rid of those. I'm also wearing, again, a choker, a velvet choker this time. So that's also kind of gross, but that's whatever. And then the top I'm wearing is from a Halloween costume I did that year, which is I was Lilo from Lilo and Stitch. So I had like that with like a grass skirt or whatever. And then I have these shorts also not my favorite i'm not really a big fan of the color and like the stripes but like i mean the color and the stripes are okay like i i mean maybe maybe back then i'd wear i you know i'd wear them but the fit of the shorts was kind of not the vibe anyway moving on this is from the fourth of july one of the years that i was down in lava hot springs in idaho i was wearing like these really like these kind of booty shorts that had like a little flower on like the pockets or whatever and then I'm wearing this giant like oversized jacket which was my dad's that's like a weird green color and I'm just not I'm not vibing with that it's kind of gross not gonna lie <clears throat> sorry I've got I've got a little bit of a cold also I'm sorry I keep looking at myself I look kind of rough today but whatever anyway moving on so this is from Orlando um, we went to um, Universal Studios, and this was the outfit I chose. I'm wearing like, okay. I'm wearing like dance shorts for some reason underneath my my shorts. I think it just felt uncomfortable, so I did that. Um, these shorts actually were one of my favorite pairs of shorts that I've ever owned because they were just really high waisted, and they gave like this, like night like 80s like vibe or whatever i don't really know i really like the like the way the style was and you know honestly one of my favorite i don't know pairs of shorts i really like this top too i don't i think i gave this top to my mom my mom convinced me to get it at the thrift store and it says the steve miller band on it um i don't really know what that band is too much my mom told me about it a little bit when i bought the shirt but there's that and that same day i got that shirt i got this like green army green hat um i had a bit of an obsession with dad hats um that's a, it was a big problem because i got a bunch of dad hats and i don't know what to do with them now so anyway moving on from that um here's me again with a dad hat this dad hat has a stitch on it um yeah anyway and then i'm just wearing like this pink top or whatever i don't know i didn't really like the way that fit either it was like very weird and loose gave that one to my sister and then these jeans oh these jeans are ugly okay so these jeans are still not my favorite i rolled them up and look they're uneven why are they uneven they're uneven when they're rolled up which bugs the living crap out of me and they're like loose but not like cute loose they're like baggy and i'm like that's kind of not the vibe right now sorry i keep saying i'm really obsessed with saying vibe lately and it's kind of a problem okay this picture is a little bit better um i do like the denim jacket i got the denim jacket from a place called vantage um marla catherine went there in salt lake one time and i watched that video and i was like mom we gotta go and when i went it was right after i started my channel the first time that video is no longer available i am sorry but um i did go and i did kind of vlog it because i was like really trying to be her because i was like i i want to be a youtuber and i want to do it and i want to do that but did i i mean yeah i'm still being a youtuber but i'm not copying her anymore because that was not the way you know i gotta be myself you know okay so the top i'm wearing is like the maroon turtleneck i did wear it in my turning myself into an e-girl video that was like the end of last year um still kind of my awkward phase but whatever anyway that was when like i just barely started out my youtube channel again and that's when i started actually doing it more but there's that and then i'm wearing leggings again i'm pretty sure 
yeah, these are leggings and they're baggy. You can see the like, the like bagginess of it. It's, mm, it's kind of gross. I'm not really here for it, but whatever. Okay, so here's me again. I'm wearing a beanie. I'm wearing a beanie with like, you know, a little puff ball on it, which is still cute. Like I totally wore one of those hats today. But the one thing that I'm wondering is why I'm wearing glasses because I don't wear glasses. I don't need glasses, but I'm wearing them anyway. I convinced myself to buy fake glasses from Claire's and I wore them at home. I didn't wear them out because I knew that I'd be made fun of for that. Yeah. I'm wearing a sweater, basically like the same one from earlier, but I think it's like a different one from like the thrift store. So there's that. Um... I don't the things I wear back then makes me uncomfortable this one is just leggy I'm wearing like leggings and this t like tank top and like a cover-up still pretty cute um this was eighth grade and I feel like I kind of got better in my style I'm not happy with the fact I was wearing leggings because I never realized how much it showed my underwear line it's kind of not cute but whatever uh I keep saying not cute, but then but whatever, and that's really annoying, and I'm so sorry. But, um, I, I mean, I like the hoops. I feel like this outfit was kind of cute, but at the same time, I just hadn't really found myself yet, so we're gonna move on from that. Again, me, long hair, I'm wearing the ugly shoes that I literally wore till death, the Vans, gross. I was really obsessed with maroon at the time, if you can't tell. I've got these maroon shorts. And then I've got this like blue top, which this was Easter and I'm wearing a choker again, but that's because my, it, it was like same kind of color scheme. It was like white and blue. So I was like, eh, we'll do it. We'll wear it. And then I need, was really into like, I started YouTube at that point too. I'm pretty, I think, or I think I was trying to, I don't know, but I was like, I need Instagram pictures now. I need them now. So I made my sister or my cousin or something take pictures of me for my Instagram. Um, I deleted those, obviously, because those were gross. I'm wearing rainbow socks for some reason. I have those rainbow socks, and I still wear them, but I don't wear them when they're being shown because that's just not cute. Anyway, moving on. We're going to move on from that because it makes me uncomfortable. Okay, so this picture is in, like, one of those interactive museums. Uh, we had one in, there was one in Salt Lake. I went, why does my hair look like a... Anyway, so uh, we went to one of those, and I wanted to look cute because I wanted pictures, and this is the outfit I chose. I decided to do, like, those, like, pigtails or whatever, and then I wore, like, these glasses that really aren't sunglasses. They're just for decoration. So I put those on, and um, I don't know why I did that because they kept falling off my head anyways. And then I'm wearing, like, these ugly, like, shorts, and I've got my dance shorts underneath, because, you know, it's uncomfortable for some reason. Like, all, everything. I Well, actually, it was uncomfortable. But also, because it, the, like, shorts or whatever came down so low that you were, like, seeing my underwear. So, I had to, like, cover that up. And then I was wearing a gray tube top, which I still own and still like to wear sometimes. Because it's, like, still cute. But it was, like, this outfit made me look like I was 10. Which I wasn't. I was, like, literally... I want to say this was the summer before ninth grade. So, I was, like, 14. And I look like I was nine. And I'm wearing like flip flops. Like, what am I doing? Okay, this is right after I cut my hair freshman year. Uh, this is a lot cuter. Okay, so this one's, yeah, this one's so much cuter. I've got like this overall dress with this t like top, this like pink striped top. I got rid of both of these because I just wasn't feeling the overall dress anymore. And the top was kind of tight on me. I don't know why I got that size. But I really do like this outfit though. That was really cute and I felt a lot. I was kind of, when I cut my hair, I honestly feel like I got more into just who I am as a person and what I, I'm still kind of finding out how I want to dress and that kind of thing. But this was the start of like a revolution. You know what I'm saying? So um, this top is actually way cute. I had, so this is my second time filming this video, just by the way. The first time I filmed it, I was wearing this top. I was wearing this top when I first filmed this video, and um, obviously, as you may know, it's literally right there, right there. And I really do like this top, actually. It's way, way cute. I started using barrettes at this time, and I honestly think that's literally so cute, and I wish I did that more. I just keep forgetting about it for some reason. 
sorry I sound really congested because I am I can't really breathe okay we're gonna move on from that okay so this is when I found my favorite pair of jeans um, this whole outfit is from a store called Urban Blues. It's in like Salt Lake and I think somewhere else. But this, these pair of jeans that I'm wearing are my favorite pair of jeans ever. Um, they, when I got them, they fit my waist perfectly. Still room to breathe. They also fit my length of like my leg length or whatever perfectly. Um, I did have to roll them up a little bit, but that's the style that I really like to wear them in most of the time. So they worked out really, really well. This Levi's top, I don't really wear it that much anymore. I honestly don't really like it as much anymore. It's just kind of got wrinkly and gross and I, it's just not it. But those jeans I still wear every single day to this day. Even though I have like four other pairs of pants, I just, I love these jeans for some reason. Here we go again, the jeans. Um, this outfit was, I thought it was so cute when I put it on and I wore it that day and I remember that day vividly. So I remember that day and um, I don't know why that this was the choice. The reason I don't like it though is because of the like belt and then the like I have the mesh long sleeve and then the crop top over top. It just looks very dark and then the jeans are a lot lighter and a brighter blue. Um, one thing I also don't like is the fact that you can see like these ugly socks. I mean at least they're matching but i just would prefer to make sure that i have socks that are hidden um but i just wasn't a big fan of the way that this was laid out i guess i wish i had like the jeans i'm wearing now which are like these dark ripped jeans i'm not gonna throw up my legs so you can see them but i'm wearing like these dark ripped jeans you'll probably maybe see them later i'm not sure okay here are these jeans again my favorite pair of jeans this outfit is so much better though because you've got like the lighter specks of flowers on the top and I've got like the open neckline, which is my favorite. And like the light pink shoes, which honestly don't match too much. But I liked, I liked the look. Um, I still like the look. Um, I really do like that belt. I have not worn it in a hot minute. So I honestly think I should pull that out and wear it. So if you're seeing this and you go to my school or something, text me and tell me to wear the belt. Because it's so cute. Anyway. I really do like this open neck though. I really like the top in general because I feel like it's not showing a ton of cleavage but it still opens up my like chest area a little bit more so I can add like more necklaces without like overlapping my shirt or something like that if you get what I'm saying. Um, that, this is one of my favorite outfits but moving on I'm wearing leggings in this picture. I know it's strange. This is the summer before this year so this was just last like not even that I mean yeah the summer we just had um uh this was right before i went back to school shopping i'm just wearing like this the the gray tube top from earlier and a denim crop denim jacket black leggings and a denim 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 bucket hat that bucket hat is one of my favorite things i own i love my bucket hats i have like three or four um they are one of my favorite things that i own um one of my obsessions, kind of like the dad hat situation, but this is better, so I'm okay with it. I'm a little mad that I'm wearing leggings, but it kind of worked out with the outfit. I think it's still super cute, so I'm okay with it. Okay, so this um, outfit is honestly one of my favorites. Um, I've never posted some of these pictures, actually, I never actually posted, or some of my recent ones. Like, this one is just to document my outfit, um, but I am wearing the barrettes. Like, at the beginning of the school year, I did use barrettes a lot. Recently, I have not been wearing them, which is kind of weird, but I'm wearing the same top from this picture. I'm wearing it layered over a dress, actually. They are both from Brandy Melville, and I'm layering it over the dress to make the dress look like a skirt, which is super cute. The dress is kind of strappy. That's why I wanted to put that over top, so then it was a little bit more modest for school. But, but that's what's going on here. I really like this, actually. I wish it was warmer so I could wear it. But no, it has to be freezing in Utah. <sighs> okay, so this outfit is pretty cute. I actually really like it. Um, I also would like this outfit with a denim, my denim bucket hat, which I have done before, which is super duper cute. But I just got these like light jeans with like a white, like a wider um, stripe down the side, which I love. And then I've got the blue, like basic blue crop top. Which honestly just kind of works really well with those blue tones, which I love. 
with the darker denim bucket hat i honestly think adds like such a cute touch um these are the jeans i'm wearing right now which are super nice these, that is back when the holes weren't so huge but i'm wearing those with some of my adidas my white like black striped adidas and then i'm wearing my what's it called leopard print turtleneck which i love to layer it's one of my favorite things to do with this top moving on to this picture i am layering the i'm layering um the top with this other one with this navy blue top with some like flowers or date not flowers but i mean yeah flowers on it um i'm wearing the exact same jeans so it's the same outfit i'm probably probably wearing the same shoes because i don't know i really like my adidas for some like a lot i wore this today um, moving on to this next picture, one of my favorite pictures, I'm wearing the jeans from earlier with the blue top, same jeans, and then I'm wearing a o-ring belt, as you can see, with this cute little blouse that I thrifted from Depop, which is literally so cute, I'm wearing like a black tank top underneath it, because I'm not about to be exposed, because that's what would have happened if I didn't wear the tank top, and then I have like the barrettes in my hair in a cute little cross position, which I think is literally so cute, I'm gonna have to do that again. I love this outfit, honestly, so much. Might have to pull it out in for this winter time, even though it's so cold. Cause it's cute. Um, this is the last picture, but this was pretty recently. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you have seen it. I got these white Converse on, which are my one of my new favorite pairs of shoes that I own. And then I've got like these kind of cream colored pants, which really are from brandy melville and they're really out here testing my waist size but it's fine and then i've got this white turtleneck layered underneath a this black top which is from a concert um i think it's honestly just one of my favorite interesting outfits i think that the black adds a nice touch to such a white and like bright outfit if you get what i'm saying but that is it for this video I guess those are my outfits um i hope you guys really enjoyed seeing what i have worn in the past years um i feel like i've really grown fashion wise i've gotten a lot better and i'm hoping to grow even more and to have a lot more fashion sense and being able to share that with you guys so yeah please comment down below what you would like to see more from me in fashion and just all that kind of stuff with my channel i really would like to grow into that direction and do some other fun stuff too as well so please comment down below um i've got my vlog channel is in the link in the description and so is my instagram so definitely go follow and subscribe to that and definitely subscribe to this channel if you haven't already i said think i said subscribe wrong i'm sorry but yeah subscribe to this channel if you haven't already and click the notification bell because i've got a lot of fun videos planned i've had a little bit of a rough time editing lately because of laptop issues that's why i'm refilming this but i hope you guys do like this video and i'm sorry it's a little bit late if you are on my instagram and you saw my video did come out today which is a friday and i hope you guys are still be mad at me i'm sorry but next wednesday i will have a new video out for you guys um and maybe even an extra one next friday as well so definitely comment down below what you guys would like to see and last but not least have a good day have a good night have a good evening or just whenever you're watching this bye